Tensor User RD is simply a Python API. It is used to optimize LLM inference on NVIDIA GPUs. Tensor RD LLM offers specialized tools for deploying LLMs on NVIDIA GPUs with quite an efficiency. With its Python API designed like PyTorch, it simplifies the engine building process. It also includes cutting edge optimizations and supports multiple GPUs and quantization modes. It also streamlines inference tasks and improves performance by a lot of degrees. We also know that now LLM's complexity is increasing day by day. And that is why there is a very huge need for optimized inference solutions. Tensor RT LLM addresses this by offering state-of-the-art optimizations, multiple GPU support, and also seamless integration with NVIDIA's hardware. The way it works is quite interesting. Tensor RT LLM uses operation fusion, which is a key technique for enhancing efficiency during LLM execution. This process significantly reduces data transfer between memory and compute cores and minimizes kernel launch overhead. It fuses activation functions directly with preceding matrix multiplication and streamlines computation and optimized GPU resource usage. The installation is quite simple. If you go to their GitHub repo, and I will drop the link in video's description, they have very clear instructions to get it installed on Linux and also on Windows very easily. You would, all, uh, you would also have to download the pre-trained weight for an existing model, and then you can build a fully optimized engine of the model, and then all you need to do is to deploy the model. The key feature of this um, Tensor RT LLM are, as I already mentioned, performance of course, which is the hallmark of it. The secondly, very easy to use, because the Python API for model setup and engine creation is very easy, very quick, and very small steps to follow. Another good thing about it, that it handles multiple GPUs. So multi-node setup is quite easy with, with it. It has a support for C++, so that is where performance also comes from. And then you can also maximize the inputs by batching it. So I will drop the link, as I said, in video description. You can read along a lot of other things about quantization. And if you uh, go to this document, which is more about quantization, it is quite good and it is about uh, floating point 3 to fp6 bf16 and a lot of other things and how you can do it and there are some mathematical things uh, which you can follow along if you're interested so this is it guys uh, i hope that you enjoyed it if you have any questions or if you want me to create a video around its installation let me know and i'll do so i hope to, that you like the content if you did please consider subscribing to the channel thank you very much